Hey guys, it's Danny, and today I have another nail related video for you guys. Um, if you guys watched, well, actually, I don't know which order they're going up in, but um, I had decided that I'm going to get more into nail art. Um, if you guys watch a lot of my older videos, you know I did a lot of nail art, like mostly stamping, and stamping is like my favorite. So I've been wanting to get more back into stamping a little bit more, do it again, maybe film some more videos like showing you guys and whatnot. Like I'm not very good, but whatever, you know, it happens. And so I decided to get some nail art stuff and I got um, on this website called Maniology, which I mentioned this in my other video, but like I said, I don't know which one's going up first. Um, I did not know was actually originally Bundle Monster, um, but I love that because I love Bundle Monster. But right now on their website, they have this, um, like a hot, I think they call it a hot buy, but it's a mystery box and it is 20 items for $20, which is great because that means every item is essentially a dollar. And then shipping is like $4.95 or something. So like right around, so you're gonna be spending right around $25 for the whole kit if you add shipping. And it does say that it is a $90 value. Um, and I will exp I'll talk about that more later. And but it's a really great deal because like I said, everything's a dollar. Everything is a mystery, so like obviously you don't know what you're going to get. And if you have a lot of stuff, especially from this particular brand you know there are there's always the um chance of duplicates it did say in the thing that you will get no duplicates in your bag like you're not going to get two like sets of stickers that are the exact same you know what i mean there's not going to be any duplicates like that but um and then these are only one per customer so you can only buy one which I mean, I kind of like because that means everyone gets a fair chance and you're not going to have this self like someone who buys like 15 of them, you know, just for funsies. Although I totally would do that too. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm kind of both those people. But anyway, so I got it in the mail and it is already open. I wanted to do like a full opening on camera, but my husband got it and he smelled nail polish again and this happened in my other package from them as well that there was a strong scent of nail polish and we were afraid something like maybe broke or opened so I opened it really quickly but I'm still going to share with you guys what I got inside my box so yeah the first thing I got were these little nail gems and this little nail wheel sorry about that my dog had to go out so I got these little nail gems and these little wheel and these are not like my favorite thing to get but I really like these ones because they're kind of like I don't know the color of them is so pretty and I really really like it and I looked that up that is on the site and they are $4.99 they're not on sale or anything they are $4.99 the next thing I got was this super cute glass nail file with this cute like arrow like design on it this one it is on the site but it is sold out and it was a weird one those normally come like in a pack of six for ten dollars well 9.99 so that means that that one had a price of a dollar 66 so that's pretty cool and then I got some plates let's do the plates now I got this one. All of the plates that are this size, the the normal size regular plates, all of them are three dollars and fifty cents. So this one is pretty cool. Hold on, let me see if it focuses a little bit better. Maybe should have left the blue on it. See, that's the thing though. I took the blue off because I think it's easier it's easier to see the design without the blue paper on it but I didn't think about how hard it's gonna be to like film it you can kind of see maybe 
I don't know. Um, if you want to look it up, this um, is BMS175. This has like a cool compass and like an hourglass and a key and a sword. You could do like some like fantasy type nails with this, like maybe. I feel you can kind of see the designs, but the reflection is getting in the way, obviously. <clears throat> this one is kind of cool. This is BMS3112, and these are all just full nail images of just swirlies and chevrons and just craziness. This one I thought was really neat. This is like a music plate. This is BMS320. It's got like a bunch of different music type things and then it's got like a little bit of hippie stuff like it's got a peace sign and it has like a little one that says like make love or make peace not war um like a a mushroom then it's got like a little boom box it has the word music a keyboard um it has the word swag and the word yolo on it which i'm like i'll never use those but whatever um it's got a little cup of coffee with a music note and a heart coming out of it right here which i like but you can kind of see Oh yeah, that one you can actually see quite a bit. So this one I thought was pretty cool. Um, I did get some plates where I'm just like, mm, like this next one, I'm kind of like, probably won't use it. Again, I probably should have left the paper on it, but whatever, this one, I don't know. I only really like one image on it. This one's weird. This one is BMS314, all full nail images again. The only one I like is this one, which is like daisies with music notes behind it. And then like there's this one like that's got like this skull wearing, you know, with the, and then like this is like a mouth with mushrooms coming out of it. This is a pineapple wearing stunner shades and headphones. And this is like a fox, no, a cat. This is like a turntable. They're just, they don't seem to go together. They're all really weird and they just, it's like, especially this one, this one just reminds me of like an acid trip for some reason. Like it's stars and it's a mouth with mushrooms growing out of it. I don't know. This one, if I was to use any image on this plate, it would probably be the daisies, maybe the skull, but I don't know. This one may just, I may hold on it. I may hold on to it for a while just to see if maybe I do end up using these in any way. You know what, now that I know that if I hold it right here, it'll actually show, I'm gonna show you guys the other ones again so you guys can actually see them. Now watch, none, no more of them are gonna focus. It kind of focused. Okay. Here's the music one again that I said I really liked. There we go, I figured out how to hold these so you guys can see them. And this is the one I said had all those full nail images that were like really weird like chevrons and like swirls and stuff. Okay, the next plate. This one I actually thought was kind of cool. It is technically like a Father's Day plate. This is um, BMS239 and there's only really like two images that like have anything really to do with dad and that's one that just says happy father's day and there's one that says love my dad and then there's like a a deer head it's so close to the love my dad that i'm assuming it's actually part of that but obviously you could just isolate that but like i like the other designs i actually kind of like the deer head And like you can see it's like got all these triangles and then like this one I like and then like that one's pretty cool. So this is actually a plate that even though it says like Happy Father's Day and stuff on it, I would still use it. I really like the one with the arrows, this one right here. So that's kind of cool. This next one is very 
like specific <laughs> because it is a wedding themed plate specifically for like I guess well it seems like this would be more so for like the actual bride than say like a bridal guest or like you know a wedding guest there are a few images on here that you could use for any time um, like they have like a little flower they do have a bouquet but you know you could still use that I guess um, there's like a little cut cake with a heart on it that you could use anytime. The word kiss, there's a little bow. But for the most part, it's very, very specific to obviously a wedding. Like there's a wedding cake. And a Mrs. and Miss, um, Mr. and Mrs. There's a bride dancing with a groom. You know what I mean? Like this is very, very bridal, like for a wedding. And I, I'm already married. I've been married for 10 years. So, I mean, I don't really have a use for this, but I really like the little cupcake. Um, so I could, and like the kiss one, you know, you know what I mean? Like I, and the one that says love down here. I might keep it for a little while and see, like if I actually ever reach for it, because there are a few little designs on here that I do think are super duper freaking cute. Um, but this plate may eventually like make its way out of my collection just from not using it very much. <clears throat> the next one I have is actually a big long one, an extra large one. And this one is dark blue and says bundle monster on the back as do I think all, all of these also say bundle monster.com. Like I said, bundle monster, that's what maniology, I guess, was before. So I'm assuming the 20 for 20 mystery bags are all gonna have stuff that's still branded as Bundle Monster in it, which is fine. Doesn't mean it doesn't work. <clears throat> I got this plate, which I love. It is called Time Machine BMXL132. And this one's interesting. because I don't know, it says Time Machine, but I'm not really getting like Time Machine vibes. It's got like what looks like maybe, like it's got like, okay, it's got two keep calm little things. Like one says keep calm and love life. One says keep calm and have fun. And it's got like all kinds of different like video game, like controllers and what look like phones. And it's got like cassette tapes, a man with a mustache, one that's a full image of just little mustaches, coffee beans and like coffee. Sorry about that, the wind like blew really hard, so. But anyway, I really like this plate. Like I said, I don't really see like any like really time machine-y type stuff, but I really do like the two coffee images. And well, I really love the two coffee images. I mean, I like a lot of them, but like those two are like my favorite. So I could really, I could see myself really doing some coffee manis. I like this one with all the words. The mustaches are cute. I like the keep calm ones. That one's cute. That would go with the music plate really good if I wanted to do like other stuff like that. This one seems out of place to me, like completely. A lot of these kind of seem out of place. Like the coffee ones with like this man and the mustache and the mustaches could kind of go together like in a, like a hipster kind of way. And then like, this one and this one and this one would go together. Um, you know, but it just seems that like, it's kind of a hodgepodge. But I like the plate. And again, these big long ones are $7 a piece. And these little ones are three fifty. dollars And then the next one I got is the last plate, not the last item, but the last plate I got. And it is another big one. And this is a Bundle Monster. This is a collab plate with I have no freaking idea what. Can you even read that word? I don't know. Anyway, this is BMXL220. And they're all full nail images. And they're all kind of like lace, like a couple of them are like really lacy. They're all really pretty. There's one that has words on it, but I don't understand. Cause like it says sunny and Monday 
Like, it looks like it says Monday City and Lola and... I don't know. Words I don't know. But it's cute. I really like the image. And then, like, again, they all kind of look... All the other images are almost like fancy wallpaper. If that helps. <laughs> That's what I see when I when I look at it, is like fancy wallpaper images. You know, you can kind of see the fancy wallpaper. This is the one with the words. I told you guys I don't know what the words are though. They're really small and hard to see and you can only make out some of them. But I really, really love this one. Okay, so that's all the plates. And I got two big ones and six little ones. So I got eight plates all together, so that's pretty cool. And now everything else is, um, I got these nail stickers, which these were not on the website. So I just, when I was doing like how much my bag is worth, so I added up everything at the end. If I couldn't find it on the website, I just put it down as 99 cents because that's what I paid for it. These are kind of cool though because they kind of match the gems. So I thought that was neat. And then I got these nail vinyls that I will never use. Well, let me see if I can get those to kind of... They may not focus because they're so shiny. But yeah, they're nail vinyls, but it says like YOLO, hell yeah, party. I'm just like, I'm never going to use those. But again, it's okay. Then I got these nail vinyls that kind of look like a brick wall. Those are kind of neat. I might find a use for those. Okay. I couldn't find these on the site either. Um, actually, I couldn't find anything on the site except for one of the, the decals and they were on sale for 99 cents anyway. So then I found these. These are cool because these are like more of a stencil and they're all animal print. Hold on. Like, I know it's kind of weird because the way this, but they're all animal print. So that's kind of interesting. I don't know if I'll ever use these, but I might. These are kind of like a maybe. Again, I couldn't find these on the site either, so. And then I got these vinyls, which are just like these dots. And then these are the only ones I found on the site, these wavy lines, but they were also on sale for 99 cents. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I know I'm not gonna use all of these. Like I'm definitely not gonna use these ones. But the other ones, have an actual shot and these are not something I would normally use or pick out but I think they're super cute and I like that they kind of match that they match the gems and the gem wheel so I thought that was kind of cool that they all match like that and then last but not least this came in a box like this and I got four nail polishes now let me just grab all four of them out and then I'll talk about them a little bit. They're all creams. So I wasn't necessarily disappointed. I only have black and white nail polish, like for stamping. I don't have a lot of colorful ones. So this was kind of cool. I did get a bottle of plain white and it is just called Bam White. So I did get a bottle of Bam White, just plain white, which is nice because my other bottle of white is old and it's been a hot minute since I've used it. So you know, it might be a little bit thick or gross, you know what I mean? So this could be nice. Then I got this one. This is a really cool color. This is called Ballet Flats and it is just a creamy, kind of like mauvey, dusty pink and I really like this color. And if I've, I've watched like little videos where they've used this and and I've seen people like review this too and people have used this as actual just regular nail polish as well um so this can I guess be used for stamping or for actually just using as nail polish because I know some brands like Conad um their stamping polish you cannot just use on your nails because it won't dry right because it's thicker so and then I got this really pretty I think it's blue but it could also be purple I think it's blue but it's called Midnight Madness it's showing up really blue on camera, but also like, I don't know, 
I like that one a lot. With the right base color, that would look really great. And then I got this one, which is actually called Toy Soldier, and I don't get the name, but whatever. And it's this like dark plummy color. Now this one, because um, I said before, when my husband got this package out of the mailbox, he's like, it smells like nail polish. You might want to open it. This nail polish was hella messed up. Um, I did contact the company. I wasn't looking for like a replacement or a refund or anything because I was like, I got this from the 20 for 20. I was like, so I know, you know, usually things like that are like as is. These polishes normally are all $6 a piece and they are all currently on the site for $6 a piece, including this one. But mine, like this one, the cap was loose again. So there was like all kinds of like leakage, hold on. Like, well, you can, oh yeah, you can totally see up in the cap. I was like, maybe you can't because the polish is dark and this is black, but you can really see. But like the thing, and I don't really care about that, but like look at the brush in this one. The brush is so, so messed up. It's not focusing. Hold on. Because you guys, you can't appreciate how messed up this brush really is. I mean, I know you can see it, but it is so messed up. Like, it, you cannot. So, I did send the company an email. <clears throat> and I sent them pictures of the brush. And I took, like, multiple pictures of the brush from, like, different angles. And I told them in the email, I was like, I'm not looking for a refund. Obviously, because this was a 20 for 20. I was like, you know, so... I'm not looking for a replacement. I like, I just want to let you guys know, like just in case. And they're like, oh, you know, and they responded right away. Like same day. Like I sent the email and I had a response within like just a few hours, which was unreal to me because usually, usually you'll get like an automated response like, oh, thanks for contacting us. We'll get to you within 24 to 48 hours. No straight up like an hour and a half two hours later I had like a legit response from their customer service saying you know oh no you know that sucks that your brush was all messed up they're like you know we're gonna send you a replacement brush like all they're doing they're not sending me like a whole polish they're pretty much they're just gonna send me just this like inside brush component because like you can pop this out and I can put the new one in so that's going to be really, like, that's so cool of them because they did not have to do that. So that's really cool. And I'm actually so excited because this color is really, really pretty. <laughs> so, yeah, so that is my entire mystery box. I have everything written down on this little pad. And I got 20 items. I counted. And I paid $20 for it. And the overall total of everything in this box, because like I said, a lot of the decals and stuff, well, all the decals, um, I couldn't find on the website. So I just put them in, down as 99 cents and not what their full retail price probably would have been. Because like I said, I don't know how much they would have been anyway. Um, and like I said, the nail file was $1.66. But anyway, the price of all the polishes together, the, all the plates, and like I said, the gems, the nail file, and then like all the stickers was $71.59. So that is just my best guess because like I said, I couldn't find any of these on the website except for like I said, this, I'm sorry, this one, and it was on sale for 99 cents anyway. So, so I just put the price down of all of these as 99 cents and not what their true retail price is. I don't know how much that is. So, but that's still a great deal. So that is amazing. I say if you are interested in like nail stamping, nail art, and you don't have a lot of stuff, do go to maniology.com and totally get their 20 for 20 deal because it is really good really really good especially because I've seen a lot of people get at least four usually they get four nail polishes because I watched a couple unboxings 
Um, you usually get about, it even says on there that you're going to get between six to eight nail uh, plates and you'll get four to six nail polishes. And then the rest is all going to be like, like stuff like this or like nail files and, and whatnot. Um, and every, I've seen a lot of these unboxings and a, most of the people get like all kinds of, you get different things. Like you're not going to get the exact same thing I did. You might get a same plate here and there or like maybe a same color of nail polish, but I have not seen anyone get the exact same thing as someone else. So that's pretty great. And like I said, these are like six bucks a piece. So these four nail polishes cost more than the whole bag. So that's awesome. And yeah, so I'll talk to everyone later. Bye.